Hello everybody. Um, in this tutorial we want to take an example of the TCB connection. Um, basically what I'm going to do here is just take an example of client and server and explain how is the connection of TCB set up between the client and server. Uh, so the client server we have uh, three stuff but before I go in depth I just wanna okay you know give you uh, an insight an overview here we have uh, we have something called the acknowledgement and we have something called the sequence and we have something called the flag or S, uh, CLT okay uh, you should notice that the acknowledgement is all the time the acknowledgement is sequence plus one okay all the time the acknowledgement is sequence plus one uh, when we're talking about a sequence we have a sequence of client and we have a, a sequence of server okay and also we have uh, sometime we need to the sequence to be equal to the acknowledgement the sequence is equal to the acknowledgement in the established connection step and we have the flag the flag might be uh, sync or sin might be sin plus or slash acknowledgement and finally it might be acknowledgement okay this is what is TCB IP model or connection about so let's back to our example uh, we have this ex uh, we have this here so first thing we start with the sequence the sequence here is 1004 and we have a flag the flag here is sync okay because we send from client to the server the server received this and the server received this and back it to the client so when when it's send it back to the client here's the request here's the acknowledgement sent back we have a flag and this flag is sync and acknowledgement at the same time so we need to send an acknowledgement in the first step we don't have acknowledgement here here we have acknowledgement, here we have acknowledgement. Okay, the, the flag is sync acknowledgement. The acknowledgement is as we seen before, it's the sequence plus one. So we got one oh oh five. What is one oh oh four plus one is one oh oh five. Now the sequence is given here is to be five oh fifteen. And this sequence must be bigger than this one, okay? So we have 104, this 550. So what what we do in the last step? We're talking about TCB, we're talking about uh, uh, three-way handshake protocol. So here we have a sequence. And this sequence is just equal to the acknowledgement. Okay, so this must be the same as the acknowledgement in the previous one. So we got acknowledgement 1005 and here we got 1005 the same uh, okay what about the acknowledgement uh, we know we kn we knew that uh, acknowledgement is just the sequence plus one so which one sequence this no this one is the sequence that we're talking about so we just take this sequence and increment it by one so we get 5016 okay and the flag here is just acknowledgement. So uh, in the basic steps, which we have done here, we, we got three steps. Okay, the first step, we have a sequence of oh, oh, uh, any number. Let's suppose this is one. And we have a flag all the time, it's sync. We send this request to the server. The server sends us with acknowledgement. 
and the acknowledgement let's let's say the acknowledgement is one plus one must be two okay and the sequence let's say five and the flag is sync acknowledgement all the time okay we send the uh, the request as a response with acknowledgement from the server to the client and the client send the acknowledgement back to the server so and what do we do here just we take this as it is like we have two here we have two here the same and we increment the sequence of the previous step which is 515 which is 5 here so we incremented we got 6 okay and we send the flag to be uh, acknowledgement or the CLT to be acknowledgement so this is basically uh, uh, an illustration with example of the TCB connection step of the three handshaking protocol. I hope you understand this, I hope you benefit from this, and I hope that I add value. Uh, anyway guys, uh, thank you for watching, I appreciate you watching all the time, and please don't forget to subscribe, see you in other tutorials. Thank you.